So, Adam West passed away today, and I wasn't sure I wanted to do a video about it. I did tweet about it a couple hours ago as soon as I heard. But, okay, so, honestly, you may be surprised at this, but I did not know about Adam West as Batman for a long time. I didn't actually know until very recently, until the Return of the King Crusader Batman movie came out, which he was amazing in. No, I, my first exposure, I, exposure, I had never been one to read credits, but from what I understand, my first time hearing Adam West was actually on the fairly odd parent as Catman. And looking at it now, I can see that like 60s, it is literally a 60s cat version of the Batman. You know, and it, it is really cool. And uh, I thought when I did eventually go back and watch a bit of his performance in the 60s version, which I did just because I heard he was so good at it, um, he blew me away. Everything he'd been in, I've heard nothing but great things about him. And I honestly am going to make this video saying, Adam West, you were a great voice actor, and uh, rest in peace, and yeah. Please, guys, be respectful in the comments. No trolls, nothing. If it's a bit, don't, don't even insult me, just let's just be respectful in the comments. Or, and if we're not going to be able to, I will disable them. I will not tolerate any sort of disrespect whatsoever. But rest in peace, Adam West. From what I understand, you were an amazing guy. From what I saw of you at Comic Con panels and stuff that I watched online, I know you were an amazing guy, and yeah. Um, rest in peace, Adam West. But I suspect we haven't seen the last of her, whoever she is beneath that mask of hers. A new member of our team? Or a crime fighting rival? Even Craig, you will always be my Batgirl. Okay, if you guys didn't know, Yvon Craig died on last Monday, August 17th. She died of breast cancer. And she played Batgirl as the in the 1966 Batman show. Okay. My deepest thought about this is... I am very, very sad. I'm not the only one. Look at the image that Adam West posted on his Twitter. It's a behind-the-scenes image when they were shooting the series. And look what he wrote. Man, this guy's just so awesome. He's so nice. Like, like he... I'm pretty sure he hosted Frank Gorshin's funeral. This guy, like, Adam West, you are the greatest Batman ever. And guy I've ever seen. It's just like, ah, oh, like doing this is just making so many people happy. And like, when she died, I bet you that Adam West probably would have cried. And like, I bet you Bert Ward might post something later on. Do you even know that she's the whole reason why Barbara Gordon was created? It's because the Batman TV show producers wanted a new character, and she was apparently the perfect role for this. So they went to the DC writers of the comic books and asked for a new Batgirl. So they made Barbara Gordon, Commissioner Gordon's daughter. And in my opinion, that was an excellent idea. And she was originally supposed to get her own TV show. You can find the pilot in this box set right here. It was originally supposed to be aired alongside Adam West, but the pilot wasn't successful, so they didn't. So they introduced her to, into season 3 of Batman. And that's basically how Barbara Gordon was created. And it was all because of Yvonne Craig and the Batman TV show producers. I mean, how awesome is that? Like, like Yvonne, you will be dearly missed. 
and you and you're an awesome bat girl. You look you looked hot too. And uh, you can read about her adventures in the new Batman 66 comic books. So, thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye, you fun.